everyone, Lauren here from Wildflowers Nail Academy to teach you how to do these crazy 3D diamond nails. You're going to want to grab your Wildflowers ombre brush to start this look if you want to copy mine. It's not completely necessary. I'm going to start with an ombre to sort of enhance the background. And so you want to apply all your colors of gel polish now. Hear me when I say, I'm doing this really sloppily. So if you're trying this yourself, uh, use the little tiny tips of the ombre brush and you just have to work back and forth. If I wanted this to look smooth, I would go back over it probably three or four more times, but this is fine. It's gonna get covered, we'll cure it. And then you wanna grab your Wildflowers Clear Puffy Gel. I'm going to just use the ombre brush because it's handy to apply this stuff. So I'm diving in there and grabbing a nice glob of the product. And then I'm going to apply this to my nail tip. So go over it quite a few times. You want it, you want a nice even coat. And the best part about this product is that it cures tack free. This is actually what we use to hold our stones at Wildflowers. You put it on, you stick your stones in, you're done. It's tack free. So today we're gonna use the 3D Diamonds and the Fidget Stylus. And this is one of those things that's kind of tedious. Now this is like a big, long thumbnail that I'm working on. So if you're not this patient of a person, you can definitely do a modified version of this nail. I touch the tip of the Fidget Stylus into the gel and I just pick these pieces up. Sometimes it's easier if you dump them out on a surface, sometimes not, and again, if you think about it, because people love to make the argument, like, I would never do that in a salon. It would take me 10 years. That's not reasonable for a salon. Well, let me just say this. It looks super tedious, but doing this takes just as long as it takes most people to hand paint a design on a nail. So as long as it's something that can be done in 10 minutes or less, I do consider it suitable for the salon. And again, this is a pretty large nail that we're doing here. So doing someone's uh, finger that would be a little smaller might be a better choice for you. If you're not a tedious type of person, if you don't, I mean, people with OCD love this stuff. I, I actually enjoy lining them up like little soldiers, like this is kind of a crazy analogy, but when you learn about the armor of God in the Bible, it talks about how they would take their shields and they would all hold their shields up in the air making this like impenetrable metal wall and when I make this nail it reminds me of that like a bunch of soldiers holding their shields up in the air I have a really wild imagination which is why I play with glitter for a living that being said line up your soldiers in a row with their shields up and just know that you might not be able to fit everything if it's getting close to the edge and it makes you nervous leave it off you're better off to just leave it off the nail because you don't want it hanging off to be picked. Scoot your rows around if you need to. Cure for 30 seconds in an LED. Now, coolest part ever. This is our thinnest top coat. It's super, super thin. It's actually what we use underneath Chrome products. So you're going to take this top coat, put one nice layer on top of this and cure it. And I'm telling you, you are going to be shocked I actually had to put on my macro lens because I wanted to show you up close. Like there's not an edge poking out on this nail. It is smooth as can be. It feels so cool like snakeskin or something. I love it. It's not catchy at all. It's the coolest. Isn't this so cool? If you guys want to pick up this stuff, our website is www.wildflowersnails.com. These are called the 3D Diamonds. And I use the clear puffy gel, the ombre brush, the fidget stylus. Now, if you're ready to completely up your nail art game and you want to dive in head first like a crazy person, I mean, if you're really crazy for nail art, you are going to go bananas for the class that we have at our headquarters. I wrote eight classes as part of the Master Artist, Artist series of classes, and you can come for the week and do all eight of the classes in a week. You're making 48 nails all by yourself hands-on, making new friends. We're here in sunny Southwest Florida. It's a beautiful place to come and visit. Um, the food's really good. Oh my gosh, the food. I love the food here. Just saying, uh, we have a blast. It's such a fun week. It's like going to camp for a week with all of your friends that are just as crazy about nails as you are. So again, it covers all eight classes, totally hands-on. I teach the classes. I love it. My favorite week.
You can sign up online, www.wildflowersnails.com, and please subscribe for a tutorial every Thursday. Thanks so much for joining me. I hope to see you next week.